Well, hello everyone, it's Terry, and this is TD More Than Just Orchids, and this is an orchid diary, and I think my phalaenopsis are going to be okay. Now this, I'm showing this, this is my nanum, trichocentrum nanum, which I'm going to give to Josh, and look, there is a mealybug. <laughs> Darn it. But this is what those characters look like if you ever see it you can see those little feet moving quickly but nice size and there's a little new growth coming up but i am going to start in the main area where i'll point out a couple of phalaenopsis that are hanging out over there first i'll pick up my newly repotted up stanhope Stanhopa, which is the predator clone of Tigrina. A bucket list. Stanhope, Stanhopa. But let's get to the Phalaenopsis that I have in here. So over here are the two that have been out the longest. Well, they're my Giganteas. That I first dealt, that I first had earlier in the summer. That one's a little bit iffy, and of course I can pull off a leaf, and so that's bad. But I'm not worried about that because one second, wait for it, wait, wait, there, bam. So this one, which I just got, is I got it from Norman's, and it was tagged Gigantia. This one is tagged. Uh, Elaine Taylor, but I'm pretty sure it's a Gigantia, but we will see. Those are both, that one is putting out new roots. And here's another Phalaenopsis. I have my corner Servi's out here. Actually, this is not a corner Servi. This is uh, Phalaenopsis KS something. But here is a corner Servi back here in the shady location, back here in a breezeway, and it is corner Servi I can't read the tag. Various, very maybe yellow. And then this is a cross that I've had over the winter that's mounted. It's putting out a new leaf there and perhaps a new leaf root tip there. This one is a cross. This is actually corner survey red crossed with red, maybe. But I collect corner surveys as you would know if you are a frequent watcher to my channel, and that one has a bud on it. Corner servies are similar to Bellinas and Gigantias, where you can't, you don't want to cut the spike off as long as it's green, because it can produce sequentially producing blooms. Over time, they may take forever, but here up here is the piece de resistance, and I am so proud because I have repotted most of the things that I should not have from Norman's and other things uh, from Big Leaf and just some other phalaenopsis that I just needed to get out of their media and they are all seemingly responding well. Here's my Coda Twinkle that's got a new leaf on it already. Um, some of these that had some heat damage on are still kicking like these two here. Um, this one down here is amazing. Uh, that is a GW Green G, Green World. Um, and then these others have been repotted. All of them were potted up in that Green Barn Orchid Supply uh, mix, the Phalaenopsis mix. Up this way, there's a new leaf coming on that Phalaenopsis. Um, I believe that one is... a. Uh, that Pyloric from Brethren. I can't remember, but that is my Kenavant times Dragon Tree Eagle. And I've got some mounts down here. That's another corner Servi that's in spike, many spikes that has buds. And there is more. There is more. Re there is more. That's my Val Valentii. And back there is that uh, one I got from Norman's that was lost a leaf, but I'm hoping. And then there's my Modesta to the left of that one. Uh, and all of these, as you can see, have been repotted. 
doing well over here even. Um, just spectacular. Spectacular, spectacular. And some are still in bloom, putting out more, more blooms. And it is such f fragrance going on now that flowers are going over a bit. But all in all, I am really happy um, with how my repots have turned out. And down there is another corner survey. That could be the Alba. I can't read the tag. And then there are others down below here. Um, yeah, and some paths sp sprinkled in. And here's another that's got a spike on it and this be a pretty yellow file. But all in all, I just wanted to show you that I think we have made it. And here's another new, new Harlequin type. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this because I'm proud to show it off to you. And on a side note, well, here's some more Phalaenopsis that I just got from Norman's, but they're both putting up their buds. And that is a Raymond Burr clone. And this is my Crinoferum, Epidendrum Crinoferum, Crinoferum, that is putting up more spikes. You can see those buds. There's about four spikes right there. And then there's another fifth back there. So it's going to be nice. That's the one I got from Equigenera. No, that's the one I got from Orchidea. And this is my precious Mok Chow Yu, Phalaenopsis. Mok Chow Yu, very fragrant. But the most fragrant right now is this yellow, yellow that's behind over here, that yellow. But anyway, folks, thanks for watching. Enjoy your orchids. Bye.